Hmm. I bet it was a sale on ham or something like that. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it was ham. I just gotta make sure that next year I don't miss the sales. Well, knowing you, I bet you're just gonna load up on candy and stuff. No way. I need to pick up stuff like sugar, salt, soy sauce, and all your basic householdy things. Huh? Oh, that's right, Kagami. You wouldn't know about any of that, would you? I suck at chores! I got it! Ha ha ha! Eye drops, huh? You need any help with that? Thank you, I'd really appreciate it. Okay, lie back and look up. Oh, okay. Hi. Now just relax. Uh, yes. Here it comes. <laughs> Come on, relax, okay? Oh, great. <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm not doing this on purpose, really. It's just that... <laughs> Your face is scary! Hmm? I've always had a problem hmm? with giveaways and stuff, because it takes forever to get the thing you sent away for. True, however, I found a way to milk twice the enjoyment out of every giveaway I participate in. How? It's always fun in the beginning, kind of like a festival, but then nothing happens and you start to forget about it, and then it shows up and you're happy again! One entry and twice the fun! <laughs> I guess if you really like something, you can find the fun in it. But I still hate the waiting around for it part. Lucky Star Lucky Channel! Hiya, Luckies! Hi, everybody! It's time for another super happy episode of Lucky Channel! I'm your navigator, Akira Kogami! Can you believe we're already on our ninth episode? Time sure flies! And sitting over here, we have a certain someone who our producer Ito's gonna say, Yo, Shiraishi, can you come here a second, too? Why? What'd I do? Oh, I'm Minoru Shiraishi, given 100% of all I got as Akira-sama's assistant. It's a pleasure to see you again. Well, today we're gonna introduce another character from the uh, show, Tsukasa Hiragi! It? It's under the thing with the... You sound like a nerdy it? turtle. Finally! Hiragi! Uh, I'm sorry? Finally, things are picking up around here! Yes, we're strapping on our loincloths and getting down to business. Right, Akira-sama? Loincloths, huh? Yeah, since I'm an idol and everything, stuff like that's a little, you know. Just keep it in mind is all, yeah? Yeah, I'll do that. Okay? Uh, how about we give ourselves wedgies with those loincloths? So I'm just gonna go out on a limb here and give you a piece of advice? You're out on a limb? If all you got as a comedian is toilet humor, you're done. I didn't know I was a comedian. And using other people's material is a no-no. You do that a lot. Cool it. Okay. Okay! What are we talking about? Oh, we were introducing Tsukasa Hiragi. <laughs> I can't believe you'd say that. What do you mean? I think she kind of looks like an idol from way back when, don't you? Yeah, I guess you're right. She does a little bit. Okay, I see it. She definitely has what it takes to become an idol. If I didn't know any Are better, I'd... Are or something? Oh, oh, oh. Tsukasa Hiragi's an idol? You didn't have to throw an ashtray at me. How long you been here, huh? Because it blows my mind that you still have no concept as to what a real idol is. Learn your friggin' job. I'm sorry. That girl's just a soothing character type. I mean, come on. With those droopy eyes and that sad look, hello. Uh, okay. Maybe she doesn't look happy. Whatever. That <laughs> hooky's not, not what's important right before. now. I'm gonna teach you once and for all, right here and now, what an idol's all about. We'll start with the posing basics. Huh? You know, I'm doing this to help you out, so it would be freaking awesome if you could pay a little more attention while I'm flapping here. Yes, ma'am! Here's how to deal when you're ambushed by a bunch of cameras. Okay, go ahead, push the button. Droopy Twink. eyes and a sad look. You see what I'm talking about? And then there's these props, very essential. It's a good thing for an idol to keep a few of these handy. Where? There's times when you'll be walking down the street looking fabulous. You never know when someone's gonna whip out a camera and start shooting, so you gotta stay frosty. And make sure your choppers are sparkly white. Shinju. Theater. Your eyes should be big and round and don't even think about blinking. Key smiles can climb to this area only. Psycho. When posing, your expressions must be natural and organic. For example, if someone lines up a medium close-up of you like this, Akira is so surprised. It's like that. Right. Very natural. There's also a version of that pose for when you and some guy are caught leaving a hotel. Oh, no! It's time to say goodbye already! Now, don't you guys forget to keep sending in those cards and letters. We really, really want to know what you think of the show. And don't forget to let me know how much you love me, too. You can also shoot us an email or call into the radio show. Yes, 
Yes, we'll be seeing you all in the next episode. Bye. We had a photo shoot, didn't we? That's right, we did. And? I wore this little pink cardigan. Ooh, you were so cute. Thank you. What's wrong? Mm, maybe not. Well, everyone said it was cute. But you were so into huh? it, weren't you? Yeah, I guess I was. Bet you were having fun. Well, I mean, looking up into the camera, the hands folded under the chin pose. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. Ah, yeah. You're totally hooked. Totally, even the cross dressing. Totally hooked. Did you check the photos? No, I haven't. Well, the manager did. Yeah? She checked the photos. Okay. She said something about a couple of shots being problematic. Well, I wouldn't worry too much about it. I'm sure they got a ton of shots of me where I'm really hot. Uh, sorry. That was a rookie move. Uh, let me make it up to you guys. She says as she enters another song. Give someone else a chance. Okay, here. You guys decide on something? I'm still looking. I'm looking too, but I'm afraid I don't know that many songs. No sweat. I'll just sing until you're ready. You think you could sing something else besides an anime song? You're in luck. It's not. Huh? I heard this before. What is it? It's Kyon Kyon. Me and my dad used to sing it all the time when I was a kid. So instead of an anime song, you picked an oldie. What? You're insulting Kiln Kiln by calling this an oldie! Look, Tsukasa, just pick an easy song. Or like a children's song. Yeah, I'm kind of looking in that section. I'm so sorry. No, it's okay. Don't worry about it. We still got lots of time left. On the next episode of Lucky Star, Konata here. You know how in World 3-1 and Super Bleep Bleep Brothers, when you get to the stairs near the end of the level, well, there's that turtle over there, right? All you have to do is stomp on it and keep hitting your A button. If you do that, you can keep hopping and jumping and kicking that sucker and get pretty much infinite lives. Cool, right? But if you keep jumping on that turtle and go over 129 lives, you die. That's it. Game over. No more lives. What's up with that? Hello? Anyone else see a problem here? Infinite lives means you live forever. Anyway, I think it sucks. But then again, maybe that's the point. Maybe the guys in that building by Tofkuchi Station are trying to teach us a lesson about moderation. You think? Next time, desires. Look forward to it!